Hi guys, Jay here, back again for another review, and this time we're going to be looking at this little bad boy starter kit, the Gusto Mini All-in-One Pod System from Aspire. Let's go then, shall we? Ah. Uh oh. I can't. Yeah. Fellas, if you clever, trust a lady never. Have you thinking back and wishing that you. Yes, so guys, this is uh, the new Gusto Mini all in one pod system starter kit from Aspire. And it's in collaboration with Element Liquids. I'm um, doing this new design at Nick Salt's. Uh, 20 milligram nicotine uh, liquid, which the pods are filled up with. Now, I picked this up from Electro Tobacconists here in the UK for 19.99, plus £10 for three pods. There it is. Nice little dainty system. I've got mine in red. Just uh, five clicks on, five clicks off. Straight battery power, but it works well. Let's have a quick vibe. Nice little mouth to lung banger. Text 510 drip tips. I've got my uh, signature tips, chameleon tip in the top. Doing it all matchy matchy system. But it's a very nice little dainty uh, stealthy system. Small in the hand. It's got a 900 milliamp hour internal battery. You charge it from USB, and it's a very, very nice starter kit. It instantly attracted me when I seen them online for sale, so I bought one, I picked one up, because I was intrigued, especially with uh, Nick Salts, what I've never tried. So, without further ado, let's dive down up close. I'll show you what you get in the box, I'll show you what the pods look like, and all that good stuff. So, come on then. And here we go guys with the up and close of the Aspire Gusto Mini. This is the packaging it comes in. In the packaging you get a warranty card. And you get a Gusto Mini user guide. Not very big but then again there's nothing to this mod so just a basic one down of what's what. You also get this uh, USB charging cable and a spare drip tip. And here is the star of the show, the Gusto Mini. It's an all in one pod system. Got mine in red. You got a Spire Gusto Mini on that side. View and window at the back. See how much juice you've got left in there. And on this side you've got powered by Element NS20 Designer Nick Salts. Good tip pops out like so. This portion slides off, revealing your pod system. This is made of uh, aluminium. Very sturdy. Nice feeling. There's your pod system. Just pulls out like so. This is the strawberry whip flavour. 2% 20 milligram. You got your bottom contact there. And your top there. Now these, they come like this and they have two rubber bungs at the bottom which blocks off the juice, which you have to pull out 
in order for the juice to feed into the coil. These come in packs of three. And in the US you get 4.5 ml juice in there, but because of the stupid TPD bollocks, we only get two ml. Which is a big letdown in my book. And a big con. But it's only a con subject to Europe and the EU. Because the US don't have the same problem we got. They get four and a half mil, full up to the top. We end up with a little you open these up, it's about this full up to here. So you got all that space empty, which is not good. Don't last very long. I'll talk more about that up up top there. And it's fitting like so. The airflow is there, non adjustable. This it is what it is. It's on like so. And you got five clicks off. Five clicks on. That's all there is to it, guys. You get a green light when it's fully charged, and it flashes red when the battery is empty. It's a 900 milliamp hour LiPo battery built in, nice and small and compact. Let's give it a quick measure. Top to bottom, you're looking at 59 millimeters. Side to side, you're looking at 45 millimeters. And the depth at the top is 20, 21 millimeters. Pretty small, compact, stealth vape. And that's pretty much all there is to it, guys. So let's go back up top. Have some vapes and uh, talk more about it. Come on then. And we're back. So, what do I think about this? Well, it's awesome, guys. As a starter kit for somebody who's just trying to quit smoking, it's perfect. This nicotine salt business is absolutely awesome. It's really, really strange. Like normal 20 milligram nicotine, it rips the back of your throat out when you take a drag. For some reason, this one is just really, really smooth. It's 20 milligram. You, you feel the, the nicotine rush, but you don't get that harsh cut the back of your throat out vape. It's very, very smooth. Very nice. Let's have a quick one. It's a nice, nice mouth to lung. Uh, you can do a restricted lung it with it, even with the 20 milligram nicotine, as I'll show you now. It's just that airflow is just right. So, pros pros, it's very small, it's compact, it's an all in one system, it's ideal for somebody who's just quitting who needs to get off cigarettes. This is ideal for that because it gives you what you need. Another pro is it takes 510 drip tips, so you can put your own matchy matchy drip tip in there, get it all going on. Another pro is the price, the price is 20, 20 quid here in the UK, awesome. For a device with this kind of quality, for £20 it's a bargain. Another pro is the build quality, build quality on this is really good. The outside is made of plastic and this sleeve is aluminium, but it feels nice, feels weighty. Yeah, it's got a nice feeling in the end. It does what it says on says on the tin. Another pro is uh, this Nixal liquid with uh, element vapors. They're doing all their usual nice flavors in this uh, Nixal design and Nixal range. So that's another pro. Well, let's get on to cons. The the biggest con is the pods but it's only limited to the EU because the pods in this they hold four and a half mil the US customers are going to get the four and a half mil full capacity but even the UK 
with this stupid TPD, stupid bollocks bullshit, we only get two mil. And it doesn't last. It does not last. You probably get a day out of one pod. Now you get three pods for £10. So that's, you're paying £10 for six mil of juice. And if you're getting through one of these once a day, then that's going to cost you. You need five, so that's two packs a week. You're looking at £20 a week to vape on this. Now, they're selling a 10ml bottle of their nicotine, their Nick Salts Liquid, for eight ninety nine, and I'm charging £10 for three pods with six million. It, it don't make sense to me. I think Element and Aspire, I think you need to do a five pack for £10, which gives you 10 mil, same as a 10 mil bottle. And then your EU customers are going to be happy with that. I'm not sure if you can refill them. I have had a look and there is a little rubber bung on the top. I don't know if you can see that. I would, I would imagine you can pull that rubber bung out and fill it up. But there's nowhere for the air to come out. So you're going to have a, you're going to be struggling trying to get your liquid in there without making a mess. But it can be done. I, I would imagine it can be done. But for me, the old point of this is that Nick, Nick Salt liquid. And because you get such a nice vape of it, I'd rather I'd rather buy the pods, but because they're so expensive, it, it's it's just not uh, economically viable to me here in the EU. For the US and uh, the rest of the world, it's a bargain. Go out and get one now. You look for a starter kit, perfect. And this Nick Salt business, oh, it's beautiful. Have another vape. You get a lovely throat. It it's a quite it's quite a powerful punchy throat, but it's not harsh and it doesn't rip your throat out, which is really strange. And you get a lovely link nick team buzz off it. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. So, all in all, it's a thumbs up from me. If you're looking for a decent starter kit and you want to quit the cigarettes, this is the way to go. But Aspire, Element Vapor, if you're watching this, sort that uh, capacity business out because it's just it's just unreal. The consumer shouldn't be paying for it. The sh consumer shouldn't be uh, picking up the cost of the TPD. It should be down to the manufacturers. They should be taking it for it, really, not the consumer. So, in my opinion... Do a five pack here in the EU, so you get your ten mil, which is fair. If you're selling that ten mil bottle for eight ninety nine, you should be selling a five pack of these pods for roughly the same price. So that way you're getting your ten mil of juice. Other than that, it's beautiful. They do come in different colours. This one's a red one. Yeah, I think you can get a blue, a black, and a silver. But I just love it. It's a beautiful little starter kit because it's perfect for me when I'm uh, lying in bed watching a film. I can just vape away on this while I'm watching the film and it's just perfect. Lovely mouth to lung. Anyway, that's it for this review, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be doing some more starter kits because I'm, I'm intrigued. Back in the day when we started... We didn't have nothing like this. We had uh, stupid little ego pens and stuff. If we had these back in the day, when I started, I'd have been over the moon. But it is what it is. So there you go. That's it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll catch you on the next one. And remember, smoking kills. Choose life.